Hi, I'm Mike Frentz, business manager here at the Derry Township School District. The COVID-19 pandemic has had an unprecedented effect on education, as well as the business of education. In order to keep everyone informed on the district finances, I will be going through an update like this on a monthly basis. The Derry Township School District, we are highly dependent on our local economy. About $48.5 million or 70%, 76% of the district's entire revenue uh, comes from these local sources. Of the $48.5 million, uh, about $40 million is billed through real estate taxes and occupational taxes. These are very dependable sources of revenue. Uh, the remaining $8.4 million is really dependent on how well our local economy is operating. We are fortunate in Derry Township uh, to have a local economy that provides for most of the needs of our schools during good times. Conversely, the local economy is struggling, is more difficult uh, for us to provide for those needs. A large portion of the Derry Township economy is dependent on the entertainment industry. And unfortunately, the entertainment industry has been one of the hardest hit aspects uh, of the economy during the COVID-19 pandemic. There are three major components that make up the aforementioned $8.4 million uh, noted before. The good news, a large portion of that is earned income tax. And as you can see by this chart, uh, earned income tax collection has remained constant throughout the pandemic. Uh, we are uh, ahead of collections from the prior year, and we fully anticipate receiving the $4.5 million in revenue for 2020-2021. Unfortunately, conversely, uh, amusement tax revenue uh, has not fared so well. In the 2020-21 budget, we've budgeted to receive $1.1 million. As you can see by this chart, uh, collections have struggled greatly, uh, and we will be lucky to receive uh, $200,000 from amusement taxes during the 2020-2021 year. On top of that, the district also uh, budgets to receive money, uh, payment in lieu of taxes for the Giant Center here in Hershey. Uh, we were made aware on August the 20th uh, that there would not be enough revenue for this payment to be made uh, for the 2020-2021 year. It should be noted that the district had already reduced uh, the budget by 25% from the amount received in 1920. Unfortunately, it was also noted that this payment will probably not be made in the 21-22 fiscal year either. When combining the uh, reduction or shortfall from the amusement tax and the giant center payment of $1.4 million with the anticipated deficit we already had when putting the 2020-21 budget together of $1.8 million, we have a projected deficit of $3.2 million for the 2020-2021 budget. The district does have a strong fund balance of approximately $8.5 million, which is how we are able to provide for students and staff needs during this uncertain time. However, without knowing how these revenue streams will return, we'll be facing some very tough budget challenges over the next couple of years. Thank you for taking the time to view this message.